today in this video i will discuss this question from gate 2016 empty paper so the question is in a typical ellingham diagram for the oxides the c plus o2 is equal to co2 line is nearly horizontal so why so first we will consider this standard equation so here this is the standard gibbs free energy change this is the standard enthalpy change this is the standard entropy change for any particular reaction so if we plot this as delta z0 versus t we will get a line like this and the slope of the line will be minus delta s0 so if for any particular reaction if this delta s0 is positive then the slope of the line will be negative because of this negative sign and if delta s0 is negative the slope will be positive so now we will consider this equation to ca plus o2 is equal to 2 cao so first we will assume entropy of solid is equal to zero because this is as compared to that of a gas because solids have very compact structure and gases have very open structure so the entropy of gases is very high as compared to that of solid so we will assume entropy of solid equal to zero so now we know that for any particular reaction the entropy change is equal to summation of entropy of products minus summation of entropy of reactants so for this equation we can assume as this is solid this is a gas and this is solid so this will be zero this will be zero and this will be some positive value the entropy of o2 so if you write this so entropy of products is 0 minus entropy of reactants is entropy of O2. So because this is some positive value, the result will be negative. So as we have the standard entropy change is negative for this line. So because of this minus sign, the slope will be positive. So as we can see here, the slope is positive. So now we will consider the reaction C plus O2 equals to CO2 which is shown here this horizontal line. So C plus O2 is equal to CO2. So for this case if we consider the entropy change for this reaction is equal to entropy of CO2 minus entropy of O2 plus entropy of C. So as this is solid, this is a gas, this is also a gas, so this will be 0. So the entropy change will be S of CO2 minus S of O2, this will be 0. So as we have one mole of each gas, the entropy change will be approximately 0. So the slope will be also 0, that's why we see here the line is horizontal because the slope is zero so the correct option will be b the slope of the line is equal to the entropy change of the standard state which is approximately zero in this case